I keep ending up in this corner right here, and I don't know how I'm dumb enough to keep ending up in this corner. Don't wait, it's a dead end anyway. <laughs> it is a tea junction. I'm gonna go around the f***ing corner, aren't I? Question, but is there a way to kill yourself? Uh, <laughs> I've been asking myself that. Part of being British is creating something and sharing it with others, like cholera or tuberculosis. So today, I built a giant torture maze. Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. I am the Spiffing Brit, your resident exploiter of friendships. And today, I have a very special video. I have spent the last few days constructing a psychological torture device inside of a game with the intent of inviting some of my friends to play it under the guise of it being a fun challenge. In reality, it is a never-ending nightmare of dead ends, optical illusions, and secret surprises. Supporting us today are the developers of this game, Meet Your Maker, who is sponsoring the video and assisting me on this wonderful quest to break my friend's will to live. So allow me to introduce you to my creation and the structure of this game. In Meet Your Maker, you're expected to raid a base and steal a big red vial of genetic material from it. Once you have it, you need to exit the base and safely escape. The game then makes this more challenging by allowing you to place traps and guards to defend the base. I, however, have gone for a different route. My base is designed to be a mess of identical spaces that simply do not end. If my friends manage to beat the maze and escape, they'll win a super secret prize that I'll reveal at the end. So let me walk you through the glorious world of Troutman. Yes, the game picks the name of the map, and you know what? Troutman is perfect. Troutman is a map of four parts. Each section is a visually distinct maze designed to confuse and frustrate. I will introduce you to each section of the maze and then we will see how our runners handle it, allowing us to save the big reveal for the halfway point. Now it's worth noting that in a normal run of Meteor Maker, this lovely HRV here, or Robodog, would lead the way to the genetic material. However, as this is a maze, and that would kind of defeat the purpose of solving the maze, I've eliminated the dog from the equation. Starting with the greenhouse. This is the first section of the maze. It is also the longest. It is made almost entirely of glass blocks and is filled with hidden loops. I can say that after building it, even I struggled to finish the greenhouse. So let's see how today's runners handle it. Introducing our five gamers today, Hazor, Dautos, Mango, Cooler Guy, and Connor Brow. So before we start, hop into the comments section and place your bets on who of these magnificent gamers you think will win, or maybe just get the furthest before they all give up. And whilst you're down there, you can give the video a like. Right, are you all sat comfortably? Good, let's begin. There are four other people running this. The person who makes it the furthest before giving up, or manages to get the material and escape first, wins. So do you understand that being the vague rules? Yes. Right, good stuff. Uh, go cross that line. Yes, sir. In three, two, one, go. Ah! Okay. <laughs> well, okay, I see why this is called the greenhouse. Yeah. All right, this is easy. The key to a good maze is that you, uh, you get stuck immediately. I'm stuck. Oh my god, you made it all clear. Oh. It's dead end. <laughs> god, I'm already broken. Well, this inanimate object is called the gut. We're in the gut right now. I don't know where left is. Exactly. You cannot break the walls. Fuck. Okay, hang on. This is loop, isn't it? That's definitely a loop. Yep. Okay, so I'm, I'm identifying this as a feature. Yes, that a is. A reference feature. Is the indeed loop. a loop, yeah. Okay. Oh. <laughs> What? <laughs> yeah, I just want you to double back on yourself. It's fine. Don't worry. Now, do I want to be going downwards? I think I probably want to be going upwards. I mean, there is a lot of glass above you from the looks of things. Yeah, yeah I, I see. Oh, this is a red wall. This is Ooh, another feature. It's the Tetris. It's the Tetris S block. Where am I? You're in a giant greenhouse, Daltos. What are we growing here? <laughs> it's human suffering. You're totally gonna make me have to go up and then I'm gonna have to like backtrack down, right? I know that's like that's like a thing that maze makers do. So I'm trying to figure out. I mean, I can tell you that you've made your way pretty much back to the start of the maze. I think I did, yeah, I recognized it. All right. Well, I don't know. I'm pretty good at mazes, but Would I feel like I'm you're... going in circles. I you're feel like this is amazing at, at mazes. <laughs> amazing. Trying to go down. Okay, Although so your that's plan is up. to go down. Yep, you are currently heading up, which is the opposite of down. But that is interesting. Oh, immediately you're taking this this little side route. Cool. And wow, you've got a lot of lot of wiggling going on here. This is like a 
very speedy. Oh my goodness, you've sped yourself right into a dead end. Now, can you remember where you've been? Um, because I did design... No, and I just... Oh, there we are. <laughs> yeah, you're now back at the start. Um... <laughs> And uh, appears to be a dead end. Nope, not that way. Yep, yeah, this is all useless over here, isn't it? Okay. Can't ask you. For some reason, you won't give me the exact way to get out of here. Just bullshit. Oh my god. Why did I say yes to this? Um, I, th I think I'm starting to recognize parts of the map. Like, I know that this is going to lead over to the gut. We're in the gut again. It goes down here. Interesting. Um... I'm, I think oh, the Tetris oh. S block is a dead end. That's a dead end, yeah. That's yeah, not I'm useful sorry. to me right now. Okay. <laughs> Just yeah. hitting the roof. Three minutes in. Does it feel like it's been ten? Time is meaningless. <laughs> Time is, is not only a construct, but it's a crutch. Okay, we're back in the gut. Are we? Oh, this looks good. This is different to the gut, I don't think, I, I don't think I've been here before. Okay, we found uh, the gold room. Which is good. Hey there, Mr. Gold. Ooh. We're down here. That is interesting. Skeletor area. I I think... Oh, no. Gold block. Damn it. I was going to say, I think I solved the maze there, but no, I was wrong. I know I'm going backwards, but I'm pretty sure... No, I'm no, this is, this, is, this is definitely forwards. Yeah. Did I just loop fucking around again? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, I hate this already. This is like the house in 13 Ghosts. And I'm Tony Shaloub. <laughs> you definitely are a Shaloub, I'll give you that. Oh! <laughs> Look, now you're back Jordan. to the other side. You're back to the other side of it. Right. Lovely. I hate this life. Uh. Oh my god, look at me. I found the shaft. Finding the shaft is like half the challenge. Was that section one? No, that wasn't section one. What, you think the greenhouse is over? Do you think the torture hasn't just begun? Embrace the suffering. I need to get down. <laughs> get down here. Okay. Uh, no. <laughs> That's that one. That's this exact same loop this as well. This is the loop. This, this, I did this. I literally did this loop because I learned about going backwards, didn't I? Guess I gotta go. Oh, God. That's a deep drop down the shaft right there. Ha-ha! Ha-ha! I like it up there. Yes. I do like it up Okay, here. big question now. Left or right? Well, left looks like a bad idea. Okay, so you might go right, maybe not. No, I'll go left. Right, and stop the clock. Uh, you did the first section in 6 minutes and 50 seconds. Yeah! Easy. Big stone thing there on the right. Mm -hmm. And there's nothing here on the left. Mm -hmm. This is where you enter double, triple, quadruple, quintuple bluff territory. <laughs> yep. Oh, this section. Now this section. <laughs> oh, goody. This is progress. This feels like progress, doesn't it? It's a lie. I can already tell that this is a lie. No, this is progress. Look at this. You've got so much, like, open space in front of you. Um, you have a choice here, left or right. Um, the choice is yours. And start tearing your own brain apart. Left. Left. Okay. Left. You go left. <sighs> Congratulations. Oh. You finished the greenhouse in 7 minutes and 26 seconds. You always go left in video games. Congratulations. Yeah. You've completed the greenhouse in 8... Oh, wait. That was the end? That was the end. Sorry, I, should, I said that slightly too soon. You've completed the greenhouse in 8 minutes and 54 seconds. Clearly the wrong answer. This is a loop. <laughs> just, Just a little bit. Just a little bit of looping. Yep, congratulations. Hazor didn't fall for that because he used a strategy of always going left. Um, so, well done. Um, it is 7 minutes and 30 seconds on the clock and you've made it into slab. With and this is a short way. Oh, short drop or long drop? Mm, long drop is where you do the number twos, so I'll go down here. Congratulations. After 60 minutes and 40 seconds, you're now into the second zone of the game. Ah, the second era is upon us. Say hello to Slab. Slab is a system of winding dead ends, all surrounded by concrete slabs. It has a good amount of vertical travelling and backtracking needed to beat it, but it should be a little bit of a fresh air after the greenhouse. You are now in Slab. Bold decision. <laughs> 
I mean, that's a decent decision, potentially. You never know. I, I don't know what you might die of in here. Maybe starvation. So I, one thing I'm noticing about this maze is I'm getting really hungry and thirsty as I'm going through it. Okay, so this will be my reference. It's quite a nice area, I feel. I feel it's oh, gone. lovely. I'd love to live here. Oh, where? What the fuck? Whoa! What the? Whoa! Whoa! Excuse Whoa! What just happened with gravity? Fuck that! What the fuck just... I don't know. Spit. I don't know. I don't. I don't have an explanation. Uh, now this this section is is quite quite fun. Um, oh goody! It might not necessarily be the way forward, but I did enjoy building it. Question: But is there a way to kill yourself? Uh, <laughs> I've been asking myself that. White wall. White wall. Feature is fun. new feature named White Wall. I'm afraid that is still part of the. Um, Part of the slab design, so to speak. New, um, new feature discovered. New feature Spiral discovered. staircase. I feel like maybe if I say this, I will create mental connection. It's a fucking dead end. It is a dead end, yeah. You've created a, a mental connection with a dead end, which is what you did in the last area. Which is, and which that is resulted what I've been doing my whole home. life. See, if you're gaslighting me, then that's even worse. Like, if, if well, you're just I'm, lying to me and I'm saying not... yeah when the answer isn't yeah, then that's just wrong. I'm just agreeing that you're saying See, did things. I come from there? No, mm. uh, then uh, that's wrong, because, like, maybe I would have thought that I came from... They are the same. How interesting. That's a dead end. Yeah. And there's definitely nothing through here. Yeah, definitely nothing. So that one is... Nada. So it's got to be this direction. Yeah, it's got to be this direction. Sure. Have you... Please, for the love of God, you, you've you made the fucking uh, miniature glass area, haven't you? <laughs> you bastard. No, it's fine, it's fine. There's just, like, some glass everywhere to keep you on your toes. I didn't want you, like, not having access to direct sunlight, because I understand Australians need it. This is the back rooms. I'm in the back rooms. You are a little bit. Very yeah, exciting. I am going down. Yeah. Very exciting. Am I where I just was? Is this... This is not the white wall. <laughs> I recognise the white wall. This isn't the white wall. I like this because I, I felt you being claustrophobic for so long, it would be fun to open up the space a bit. Um, this... And bring back some old friends like the greenhouse. So. Um... Yeah, I just... This is like caving in Minecraft. Yeah, this is impossible to mentally catalog. <laughs> I mean, there's so many potential pathways back there that you didn't take as well. Well, I'm back in the gut. This isn't the right way. I'm not sure if you would put a big open hallway space in as like a red herring or something. I feel like I have to go back up here. That's a really obvious loop. Oh, I'm I'll sorry. Build your, own, build your I'll own maze, then. Do it. No, 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 I'll still do it three times, Good. just to make sure. <laughs> I want to get my money's worth out of that. When you asked me if I wanted to run your maze, I sort of imagined I would be checking every single wall for hideous traps. There's clearly open spaces that you can adventure on. <gasps> and a tea! Are the teas like breadcrumbs? Um, can I ask you that? They're breadcrumbs, if crumbs have been left out in the air to go mouldy, sure, yeah. Um, <laughs> there's no, there's no like, symbolic nature to the letter T being everywhere. Okay, we've learned some things. Is it, have they we? are the same. They are the same. Yeah, 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 they are yeah. the same. They are one you and the same. You know what's also between. the same? This area that you've already been in. Yes, I know about this area, and I know I've been here. <laughs> You're just double-checking it again, I guess. What do you want me to do with it? <laughs> How do I get out of it? If it's the same, no, my brain doesn't work. No, it's you, different. Yeah. Okay, it's different, yeah, different surprise. Well, I'm, I'm going back to my lower, lower failure area. Oh my! Did you make this fucking map? Was this you? Yeah, I see. I built the entire thing. Yep. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, you're killing all of my teas. Jeez, you meant to keep them Look, alive. We don't have any Yorkshire tea here. I have an idea for a video. Have you ever heard of torture? It could be gaslighting me right now. It's so not. This. <laughs> it's no, not this is the back door. rooms. This is I'm the in the back rooms. rooms. <laughs> uh. This is the white wall. <laughs> I have a talent called following the shiny show. Mm -hmm. Has that talent helped you much? No. No. I mean, it's usually meant to be quite educational, I feel. 
A shiny show. Give yourself a shiny. I got to this section. I'm going to give myself a shiny. Oh, you got to this section? Well, I'm going to give you more than a shiny. I'm going to say congratulations. You've actually just completed Slab. You're now oh. in the section known as Happy Land. There you go. You found it. Congrats. Right, stop. Congratulations. You've completed Slab in, uh, is now 12 minutes and 11 seconds. You may continue onwards. Um, down there. And you actually beat it, congratulations. Oh my god. Yeah! Congratulations, you completed a uh, slab, whether you know it or not. Um, that actually took most other people a lot longer than it took you. After the joy of the slab, I will combine our middle into happy land. A combination of white brick, red metal and bedrock to create a very simple pathway to the finish. Some would say it's too simple, but we'll punish their hubris soon enough. There you go, you found it, congrats. Okay, um, you're now in the third hollow. section. This is happy land. I love happy land. I feel so happy. Um, I will tell you if you accidentally go back out the entrance of Happy Land because... Yeah, there's not much of a distinction between them. Yeah, because everything else is a dead end. What are you on? Is it? I know it's not. I know that it is. I know that you went up to a section, said, oh, going this way would be going backwards, when in fact it is actually forwards. <laughs> I just said that. Where on earth? So I am just flipping, flipping my mouse around incredibly quick. Is this how you play CS:GO as well? Is this why you literally can't hit? Anything? Yes. <laughs> oh no! I have to go back. <laughs> Spiff, I have to go back. What do you mean you have to go? Yeah, you have to go back through the maze once you're done. Ah, oh, this section of Happy Land. Yes, I know this section. Oh, oh, lovely. This is the oh, dead lovely. end, useless section of Happy Land. How dare you! I can say you're the, f the you've got you've gotten the furthest out of anyone else who's ever run the maze. Largely Wait, is anyone are, else you? No, yeah, it's only me. It's just you currently. Um, but that's still an achievement in its own right. Did I just completely miss you? <laughs> Don't wait, it's a dead end anyway! <laughs> yes, you did okay, complete this, this section, yep. Uh, good luck. Yep. Do great. Almost uh, completed this uh, section, which you should be quite proud of. Quite proud of indeed. Um, yeah, and it's only taken you 15 minutes, so you've done a splendid job. Yeah, that first section was greenhouse, was way harder. Yeah. This, uh, I feel like I can get my bearings a bit in the greenhouse. I had no idea what I was doing. Well, would you, and you've done it. You've actually completed Happy Land. Okay. With that over, you have actually made it to the final section. Uh, just up ahead is the summit. Finally, we've made it to the summit. Ah, oh, beautiful. Home to the goal of the maze, that lovely genetic material. This section is actually super short and can be completed by just going left against the wall. And whilst it might feel simple, it's also where our runners will realize the surprise we have in store for them. Um, okay, welcome to the final section. You did it in 23 minutes. This is the summit. Good luck. Uh, it's very short. <laughs> I can hear them. <laughs> what, what could you hear? What could, what could you hear? Okay. 20, 24 Aww. minutes about to be on the clock, Hazel. Oh, no, it. no. All of a sudden, I know what I was supposed to do. <laughs> Good luck. You've completed the maze. Or at least this section of the maze. So, welcome. You're now in the final section. This is the summit. It is the simplest section of the maze because you can literally complete it by just hugging left. Um, that, that is what I'm doing. How did you know? There you go. You've made it to the genetic material. Wow. Congratulations. Yeah, this is brilliant. Good job. That's the end. Now you've got to grab that. Oh, no. This final section is the summit. Uh, it is the easiest section of the maze because you can literally just go left and it will take you to the destination. You know, you would say um, that. I think I'm gonna go right instead. Uh, sure. Um, now, after picking that up, I would strongly recommend you place down your respawn beacon on the floor next to it. And that is the only thing I will say. Welcome to the finish line, uh, which is the summit. Good luck. 
Um, the home goal of the maze is incredibly easy to reach now. Um, it is an absolute walk in the park if you just actually went in the right direction. Right direction, um, yeah, fuck you, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I won't lie, I deliberately designed this last section so that you could just go left and then you just hit the end, um, which is what I thought would be a good idea. I, yeah. You you put no... Yep. Yeah. Hmm. 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 <laughs> Suspicious wolves. <laughs> oh, dear. It's fine. Don't worry. You've got this. You've got this. It's all good. Every runner has now collected the genetic material, and while some are faster than others, they now have to escape the maze. To make everything more challenging, I have filled the return journey with deadly traps that will one-hit kill the player. They can use their two respawn beacons to dodge death twice, but if they misplay, they'll have to start the maze from scratch. It is the ultimate punishment of the maze. Now, I'm going to group our return runners into Doubtos and Mango, followed by Cooler Guy, Hazor, and Connor, as the two groups used very different methods to escape. Let the torment begin. Doubtos, there is an enemy in front of you, watch out. I would recommend putting down another spawn beacon because your last one just got destroyed. I shot him in the gut. He just died a horrible death. So I feel like the other jabronis, like, Wait, they ran forward really quick, right? They didn't take this. We're going to be smart. We're going to be monkeys. See nothing? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Spiff. Okay, Spiff. Ha <laughs> Yeah. This is a fun game. Wow. Make your own torture chamber for your friends. You must now leave. Remember, you only have one life. If you die, you've got to go back and recomplete the maze. Um, and you ah! have just died, so... Wait, what? You now need to press retry and go again. Wait, I didn't put my gen down. Oh well, now God. I've lost, so I'm annoyed. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Are you sure no one else got caught out in the exact I'm same way? I'm fucking sure. I'm okay. sure. Sure. Ooh, 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 ooh. Uh, 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 mom! Okay, we're okay. I don't need you, mom. One thing I love about Mango is the unrelenting confidence and everything. If you're gonna blag your way through life, you yeah. just have to fucking do it. I know, that's the problem here. I, I'm I'm all turned around all of a sudden. Well, they always say stick left, right? That, yeah, stick left and then right is normally what they say, yeah. Jeez Louise, Spiff. I, I sort of recognize some of these areas. You have technically just gone back into Happy Land. Oh, son of a bitch. Keep ending up back over here by Happy Land. You are, yeah, firmly, comfortably looking back at the same spot in Happy Land again. I, I keep ending up in this corner right here, and I don't know how I'm dumb enough to keep ending up in this corner. Still going to follow my advice, though. No, I'm not. There you go. This is the direction. Yeah, I wasn't listening to you. Oh, okay, I, okay. Right, this is where I just was. This is a gold block. This is a good place to understand where I am. Listen, everyone else, you're welcome to do this. Download the game, Troutfish, or whatever it is, Troutman. I can't just seem to get out of here. I don't know where to go. Everything's at that end. Right, there's Mr. Gold Block again. Hello, Mr. Gold Block. Hello, Mr. Gold Block, my only friend. Hello, Mango. What <laughs> brings you uh here? Uh, I don't want to talk to Mr. Gold Block ever again. <laughs> ah, I've been down here! You have. I'm so upset that I've lost. You don't understand. You haven't lost. I've lost and it's really annoying me. Ah, why can't I competently go through the spot? Why do I keep ending back in Happy Land? It's me! I Mr. hate you, Mr. Gold Block. Block! I hate you! I hate you! I'm okay. invulnerable! Uh, right, ah. okay, um... The Gold Block version 2. Hello, Mango, it's me, Mr. Gold Block version 2. <laughs> oh no. I'm starting to get hot. Like, I'm starting to get frustrated. My body's getting hot. Are you feeling like mentally kind of a bit annoyed, like pissed off? Slightly? A little bit. A little, a little bit. bit. That's good. That's really good. That's that's what we wanted. What? Oh, it's Mr. Gold. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Where the fuck am I? Oh my god. How do I keep ending up here? Shiny is my friend. I understand what I'm doing. There's no immediate danger here, okay? It doesn't matter. It's where I'm spawning and it's where I've decided I'm spawning. Uh... Um... 
I'd I'd get a wiggle on. Good job. Good job. <laughs> you go through that doorway. That's happy, lads. You've done it like five times now. I don't know where I am. <laughs> Does Happy Land make you happy? Is that why you want to return to it? No. I hate it. This seems different. Hang on. Oh my god. <laughs> Can't wait for you to somehow find a way to go back to Happy Land. I think I'm on the right track now. This seems familiar. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. You do have your grenade still. I know. Oh. You can just try and dodge it. Like, if you drop, drop down, it will trigger, and then you just walk out the way. Watch out, You're there's my board! Shit. You're a fucking shit. I tell you what, you told me I could dodge it. You should give me another way. I wasn't expecting you to go left, and also I forgot Where there was a trap to the I left. Where else would I go? That's a, I'm sorry. It is a T-junction. Okay, 48 minutes. You can go again if you want. I am going to go make myself a cup of tea whilst you do this, though. No one has taken this long. Would you like a cup of tea? No one has taken this long, and you know what? You've embarrassed me, and it's all your fault. I can't tell you no one has taken this long, yes. How did I manage that? All right, okay. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Back in Happy Land. Some people excel in different things. You're not, you're not going to put Stephen Hawking in the middle of the African Serengeti and tell him to survive, right? Well, I mean, he's he's dead, Daltos, so he'd have a little bit of a hard time doing that. Oh, I'm back in this spot again. Um, I'll go make you a cup of tea. Uh, no, you can't leave. You can't leave the run. I'm actually thirsty, though. Yeah, well, you are not allowed to leave the run. You have to watch me do my run. I'm not meant to be trapped here in here with you. It's meant to be well, the you other are. Around. You are trapped here with me. And you know what? I'm starting to enjoy it. Okay. All right, we're back. Okay, okay, so there's gonna be a trap up here at the end. All right, we're back to here. Okay, we're good. All right. This reminds me of a time where I was doing surgery on someone and they were like, you got 30 minutes before they die. And that just made me really nervous. T! Oh, the T stands for T. I get it. Oh, here we go. It's Mr. Goldblock! Welcome back to the greenhouse, Daltos. Well done, well done. One section to go. I can't hit that thing up there. Don't say there's no traps in here. As soon as you say it, I will die. Yeah, I, I can't say if there are or aren't traps. I can't remember if you've completed all of the traps now. I'm not certain. There we go. You were waiting for me to run into that. You stayed quiet. I'm waiting for something to sneak up on me here, and then when it kills me, I'll rage quit, and you'll never hear from me again. Help. I need, I need somebody. somebody. Help. Not just anybody. Help. Oh, my God. Spiff, you have no idea how terrified I am right now. I don't want to, like, turn the corner and get killed by a trap. Oh, my God. I feel like I'm near the end, but now I feel like I'm completely turned around, and I don't know where I am. Why is this right. here? Yeah, why is that section there? Maybe that's the exit. Is this the right way? Because that trap wasn't there before. This can't be the right way. This is where I came up from. This is so confusing because you're just in a bunch of glass walls that all look the same. All I know is that this is a dead end right here. This is how I track where I am. I want to go this way instead. That's the gold block room. Oh my god, Spip, I hate you. I hate you. God damn it. Whoa. Ah! Oh, fucking hell. I why thought that was going to be it. I don't know why. Oh. I guess I didn't give it the range extension, um, but I think... Oh, I know it's the end. Yeah, this is the end. Come on, cross the line, cross the line, cross the line. You've got to extract, you've got to extract. Run, 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 run. Press F. Press F. You did it. I did it. One hour, 16 minutes and 20 seconds. Congratulations, you beat the base. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> you did it, Daltos. Well done. Whoa, 40 minutes and 22 seconds. Well oh. done. And with that, Daltos and Mango have now just completed the maze by going back the way they came. And in Mango's case, also doing the maze three times. However, wouldn't it be a shame if instead of wasting their time, a secret, easier exit might be found right at the end of the maze to, you know, make it an absolute breeze to complete. Oh dear, I'm so sorry, Mango and Daltos. I yeah. hear monsters as well. 
<laughs> Remember, you only have one life, so watch out. <laughs> uh, you can place down the beacons that mean if you uh, respawn. So um, you've got to make your way back out now, so good luck. Uh, you're going to do great. That is going to open. I know it. <laughs> oh my gosh, you also dodged that wall trap. Good job. Good job. Well done. Well done. Yeah, please tell me there's an easier way out. There's not. You've got to go... <sighs> Congratulations, you found the easy way out. You actually did. Well done. Go on. <laughs> As I said it. <laughs> you can can you fall for full damage? Okay. Yep. Okay. Okay, keep going, keep going, keep going. And escape. You did that in 30 minutes and 2 seconds. Congratulations. Well done. That was a very was exactly good time. Exactly half an hour. Exactly half an hour of my life has been gone. Yeah, I knew it! <laughs> I can smell you. Good job. Now, any way out, um, including shortcuts or whatever, are usable. Um, watch out, though, because you only get one life. Only yeah. one life. <laughs> Holy shit, you found the shortcut first time. Oh <coughs> my god, Azor. Well done. <laughs> well done. Yay! 24 minutes and 40 seconds. Congratulations. Oh, someone's gonna do it in like 10 minutes. Well, oh, you God. beat Troutman. Um, and I can tell you that on the return leg, there are basically traps everywhere. Um, it's It becomes a nightmare. And if you don't take that secret shortcut out, you are just screwed um, throughout the uh, rest of the game. Everyone's going to find that secret shortcut and they're going to get to the end before me. No one's going to find that secret shortcut. You're going to win. Don't you worry. I believe <laughs> in you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, okay. Uh, so 16 minutes, you've grabbed the uh, genetic material. Good luck. Um, nice grenade. You killed the guard. Good job. So, I mean, you can probably guess there's another guard there. But watch out Fuck for that! You. <laughs> oh, I knew no. it! I knew it! Oh no. Oh, if only you'd put down your respawn beacon. I, I did not even fucking have one of them. Right. You're gonna do it again. Oh my god, fine. Um, so 60 minutes and 38 seconds. I'm, I'll continue the clock, basically. Um, <laughs> good luck. Where the hell am I? Uh, you've completed oh, there we it. Are. Okay. Uh, you're not at the summit. So bam, there you go. Splendid. And it only has one use, so good luck. Nice, nice clear. Oh, good job, good job. Good job, you did that nicely, and you killed that guard. Well done, well done. I guess you now need to go recollect your bolt, don't you? There's nothing exciting in there. Mm. Or is there? You actually... Um, you've yeah, done I was expecting well that. You found the secret escape. Uh, it's going to be a real shame when someone doesn't. But congratulations, you did it in 22 <laughs> minutes and 58 seconds. Well done. If I didn't die the first time, I would have been so fucking good as well. I can tell you that if you didn't die the first time, you would have had the record setting time. <laughs> um, guaranteed. I can tell you that it is pretty close, but I'm not going to say if you won or lost. But well done. And with just under two minutes between them, one caller guy beats Hazel with an astounding time of 22 minutes and 58 seconds. His prize for winning today is not only the sense of glorious satisfaction, but it is also one of my prized possessions, a supremely rare item on Steam, the Cucumber Emote. A huge congratulations to everyone else for actually surviving the maze, especially Doubtos and Mango, who effectively did a maze that was 20 times harder than everyone else's. If you enjoyed today's video, then please give it a like, and if you want to try the maze, out for yourself, then go grab yourself a copy of Meet Your Maker and time yourself running Trout Man. The fastest time that I receive by the end of the month will be receiving a cucumber of their own. But seriously, I hope you enjoyed it. A huge thank you to the developers for actually supporting this mad project. And if you want to see more things like it, then do consider subscribing and joining our lovely community. Of course, as always, a massive thank you to all of our lovely YouTube members and patrons whose generous support not only funds some of these videos, but also for some reason appears in these videos. Congratulations, caller guy, you absolute madman.
can. And hey, if you're sat there wondering what to watch next, look no further than this video on screen now, chosen by myself to be perfect for you. Anyway, I'll see each and every one of you in the next one. Have a lovely day and goodbye for now.